Hi, my name is Ben Branta and I'm an electrical engineer at Pierce Manufacturing. Today I'm going to tell you about the new IRT aftermarket system. The IRT system pairs automatic diesel engine controls with high performance lithium ion batteries to reduce engine wear, lower fuel and def fluid usage, reduce soot buildup due to idling, reduce carbon emissions, and lower the overall operational costs of the apparatus. As you can see here, we have the new IRT aftermarket system. Within the aftermarket system, we have our high performance lithium ion batteries. These batteries will connect in parallel to the electrical chassis system when you go into IRT shutdown. These provide a stable voltage discharge profile, which will allow you to run all the lights you want up to 150 amps for one hour. Within the case, we have a built-in control system that monitors your critical safety and operational interlocks. And then on the apparatus itself, we have at least three lead-acid batteries in order to crank the engine. The case itself is approximately 25 inches long, 15 inches wide, and 15 inches tall. The case itself is currently designed to be installed in your dunnage area. There are a few key differences to note when comparing the production IRT system to the new aftermarket IRT system. First off is the controls. The aftermarket IRT system will come with an external CAN keypad which is used to control the system. This keypad can be installed on any blank switch panel within the cab and it is IP67 rated, so it could be moved elsewhere if needed. As you can see here, we have the cab temperature control system. The operator is able to set a desired temperature set point, and IRT will monitor cab temperature and ensure that temperature is maintained. For example, during IRT shutdown, if the, temp if the operator wants a cold cab, they will enable cooling. When the temperature exceeds that, say it goes too hot, IRT will restart the engine. It'll begin to blow cold air using the HVAC control panel and shut the engine back down once the cab cools back off. Once the IRT shuts back down, it'll continue to monitor your safety, operational, and now temperature interlocks. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about Pierce's idle reduction systems. If you have any questions, feel free to visit us at our booth at FDIC, visit our website, or contact your local Pierce dealer for more information. Thanks.